What's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm gonna to be bringing you guys another top four basic mail chart outfit video. So the first outfit that I'm wearing right here will be the first outfit I'm gonna show you how to make. So for the first part of this glitch, you will wanna go ahead and get the black jogger. So first you will wanna go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to services, click on services, scroll down to mobile operation center, and you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and request your mobile operation center. After you do request your MOC, go ahead and wait for it to spawn. So mine will spawn probably right here. Whenever your MOC does spawn, go ahead and go to the back of your MOC and you're gonna wanna go ahead and go to your mobile operation missions. When you do get to the back of your MOC, you guys will wanna go ahead and first join a CEO or an MC. After you did join one of those, you guys will just wanna go ahead and go to your mobile operation. When you are here at your mobile operations, just go ahead and log in. Scroll down and, and look for the work dispute job and you're just gonna wanna go ahead and launch this job. If you guys have not unlocked these jobs, then you guys will have to do your bunker missions to unlock the work dispute. So once you get the work dispute job unlocked, then you can go ahead and just launch the job. After you do load in here, make sure you do set your difficulty to easy so then you guys have more lives. And after you did set your difficulty to easy, confirm your settings and just wait for a friend to help you out. I wouldn't do it with a random because those just random people will mess up the job for you. So just wait for a friend to join and you can just go ahead and launch the job. When you load it inside the plane, you guys should see that you guys are wearing the black jogger since you guys are the first player. Now you're just gonna wanna go to your apartment. You guys cannot see your apartment on the map so you're just gonna have to remember where it's at. And I'll just get back to you when I do get to my apartment. Whenever you do get to your apartment, just grab a RPG or a sticky bomb, just any explosive, and you're going to want to go ahead and walk to the blue circle, either at your apartment or at the house. Whenever you are here, uh, just walk into the blue circle, and you're just going to want to blow yourself up. After you do blow yourself up, you, whenever you spawn in, you should be able to just walk inside your apartment. After you do get inside your apartment, you guys will just want to go ahead and go down to your closet area and just hit right on the D-pad to change your clothes. When you are here, scroll down to your accessories, click on accessories, scroll down to gloves and just click on gloves and you can just put on any pair of gloves that you guys want. After you guys do choose a pair of gloves that you guys do want, you, you will now just want to hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want. And after you do save this outfit, you can now just back out of the closing clothing section and just pull up your phone and just leave the job from your phone. Once you are back in a public session, you should see that you guys are wearing the outfit with the black joggers. And now that you guys do have this outfit, you're just wanna you're just gonna wanna go ahead, head to the clothing when you do get to the clothing store, I'm going to go ahead and show you on how to make this outfit. So you should already have the black joggers. When you do get to the clothing store, walk over here to your tops. When you do get to your tops, go ahead and scroll down to sweaters, which will be right here on slot 39. Click on sweaters and you're going to want to go and equip the black combat sweater, which is on slot 93. So after you do equip the black combat sweater, you can now back out of the sweaters and scroll down to utility vest, which will be right here on slot 53. Go ahead and click on utility vest. And you're going to want to go ahead and buy and equip the ice plate carrier, which is on slot 50. So after you do have the utility vest and the sweater, you can now go ahead and back out. Walk over here to the shoes. Once you do get to the shoes, scroll on to sport shoes, which is on slot 9. Click on sport shoes and go ahead and equip the all white sport shoes, which are on slot 28. And now after you do have the shoes, go ahead and back out. Head over here to the accessories. Once you are here at the accessories, scroll down to gloves. Go ahead and click on gloves and you're going to want to go ahead and equip the white cotton gloves which are on slot 53. After you do have the gloves you can now go ahead and back out of your accessories and now you're just going to want to go ahead and equip the night vision goggles. So pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories and on your gear go ahead and just scroll maybe two times to the right and it should be the night vision, the night vision goggles. If you don't have the night vision goggles go ahead and go to the gun store and you're going to want to go ahead and go to the middle counter. When you go to the middle counter, it's going to be the gear. And you guys should see the night vision goggles whenever you get to the gear. So just go ahead and buy the night vision goggles. After you do that, go ahead and equip it just like I showed you. And now for this, you guys will want to go ahead and 
go to someone's yacht. It doesn't matter if it's yours or if you are in a public session, just go ahead and go on to someone's yacht and you're just gonna wanna go ahead and go to your go to their hot tub. So I'll just get back to you when I do get to my yacht. When you do get to a yacht, just like I said earlier, it doesn't matter if it's your yacht or someone else's yacht that's in a public session. So whenever you guys have the night vision goggles on, you're now gonna wanna go ahead and walk up to the hot tub, pull out a sticky bomb, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and put it on the first step on the stairs. After you do that, you're now just gonna wanna go ahead and walk into the hot tub, and as soon as your character changes, you're gonna wanna go ahead and just blow yourself up. And whenever you do blow yourself up, make sure your character flies out of the hot tub. If he doesn't fly out of, fly out of the hot tub, then this glitch won't work. So just make sure your character flies out of the hot tub. So just like I said, as soon as your character changes, go ahead and just blow yourself up. And my character flies out of the hot tub, and you guys can see that my character's kind of bald, but with also the night vision goggles, just like this. So whenever you spawn back in, your character should look like this. Now you're going to want to go ahead and go to the mask store so we can just save this outfit. When you do the mask store, this is what your outfit should look like so far. So after your outfit looks like this, you will just want to go ahead and walk over here to the mask, hit edit saved outfits, and just save this outfit on whichever slot you want. It doesn't matter. But after you do save your outfit, go ahead and back out of your edit saved outfits, scroll down to your mask, and scroll down to ski mask which is on slot 19, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and equip the black tight ski, which is on slot 114. After you do equip the black tight ski, you can now go ahead and back out, walk over here to the hats, scroll down to canvas hats, which is on slot three, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and scroll up or down to uh, slot 59, and make sure you do buy the white mod canvas. So after you do equip this mask, or after you do equip this hat, and if you guys already own it, you guys don't have to equip it, but if you guys don't own it, go ahead and buy it real quick, and then go ahead and re-equip re the black tight ski. So now, you guys will just wanna go ahead, after you have the black tight ski re-equipped on your character, go ahead and head to the pier so we can do the telescope glitch. Once you are at the pier and you guys are near a telescope, just do the telescope glitch. So go and run past the telescope, hit right on the D-pad, and you'll see that your character glitches where his mask does come off. Pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, and scroll through your hats until you do find the white mod canvas. And when you do find the white mod canvas, you can now put away your interaction menu and walk away from the telescope. And once you do walk away from the telescope, you should see that the hat and the mask do combine together. Now you're going to want to go ahead and do the telescope glitch again. Whenever you do the telescope glitch again, pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, and scroll down to your outfits, and go ahead and equip the outfit that you just saved with the night vision goggles. So after you do equip this outfit, this is what your outfit will look like. Now just walk away from the telescope and you should see that the mask, the night vision goggles, and the hat combine all together just like this and this is what your outfit will look like. Now for the parachute, pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to parachute, and make sure your parachute is set to on and you're going to want to go ahead and scroll down to bag and make sure it's set to the South Korea shoot bag. After your, after your parachute is set to the South Korea shoot bag, if you don't have the South Korea shoot bag, go ahead and just go to the gun store go up to the front counter, go to parachute, go to parachute bags, look for the South Korea shoe bag, go ahead and buy the South Korea shoe bag, and then just equip it how I showed you right here. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this outfit. Well, actually, one thing I did forget is actually you can put on the flight tube, so I can actually go ahead and show you on how to do that right now. So you're gonna wanna go ahead and actually go to the clothing store right across from the strip club. Whenever you do get to the clothing store, one thing I did forget to say since we did add the parachute, you'll just want to go ahead and go up to the front counter and just hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit again on any slot, it doesn't matter. After you do save this outfit, go ahead and back out and scroll down to flight suits, which is on slot 9, and you're going to want to go and equip the black flight suit, which is on slot 2. After you do equip the black flight suit, you're now just going to want to go ahead and just run across the street to the strip club. Once you are here at the strip club, just go ahead and walk inside. Whenever you do get inside, you can just pull up your interaction menu. Whenever you guys actually see that the flight tube does come off your character's outfit, that's whenever you guys know that you guys are good to go. So just pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to outfits, and go and equip the outfit that we just saved. So after you do equip the outfit, you can now walk outside the strip club door, and you'll see that the 
flight tube does transfer over to this outfit. So now go ahead and run across the street again back into the clothing store to save this outfit. After you save the outfit, that's pretty much it for this outfit. So I hope you guys did enjoy this outfit glitch. So now let's go ahead and move on to the second outfit. Okay guys, this will be the second outfit I'm gonna show you how to make. For this outfit, whenever you do get to the clothing store, go over here to your tops. Whenever you do get to your tops, go ahead and scroll down to sweaters, which will be right here on slot 39. Go ahead and click on sweaters and you're just gonna wanna go and equip the yellow sandcastle sweater, which is on slot 61. After you do equip that sweater, you can now back out of the tops, head over here to the pants section. Once you do get to the pants, click on jeans, which is on slot one, and look for the black fitted, which is on slot 56, and go ahead and equip those jeans. Once you do equip those jeans, back out of the pants, head over here to the shoes, scroll down to canvas shoes, which is on slot four, and look for the yellow canvas shoes, which is on slot 10, and go ahead and equip the yellow canvas shoes. After you do equip those shoes, you can now back out of the sh shoe section and head over here to the accessories. Once you do get to the accessories, scroll down to gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and look for the refuse collector gloves, which is on slot 54, and go ahead and equip those gloves. And after you did equip those refuse collector gloves, back out of the accessories and pull up your interaction menu. Scroll down to inventory, click on inventory, scroll down to body armor, click on body armor, Scroll down to show armor and make sure it's set to the standard armor. After you did that, that's it uh, so far for this outfit. So now you can go ahead, go up to the front counter, save this outfit on whichever slot you want. And after you do save this outfit, you guys will want to go ahead and back out of your edit saved outfits. Scroll down to flight suits, which is right here on slot nine and go and equip any flight suit. It doesn't really matter. After you do equip a flight suit, you can now walk over here to your hats Whenever you do get to your hats, scroll down to flight helmets, which is right here on slot 23. Click on flight helmets and you're just going to be looking for that yellow checkerboard uh, flight helmet. So it should be right here. It's called the yellow and black flight helmet. Go ahead and equip that helmet. After you do equip that helmet, you're now going to want to go ahead and head to your apartment or your CEO building, whichever has a telescope so we can do the telescope glitch. So when, when you do get to your apartment or your CEO building, you're going to want to go ahead and just go to the telescope so we can do the telescope glitch. If your helmet does come off, go ahead and just go to your closet area. Go ahead and re-equip re the yellow and black checkered flight helmet, just like I have here. And then whenever you guys have your helmet back, you can now just do the telescope glitch. So once you are near your telescope, go ahead and run past the telescope, hit right on, hit right on the D-pad. You'll see that your character glitches where his mask does come off. Pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to your outfits, and just scroll through your outfits until you find the yellow outfit that we just saved at the clothing store. So after you do equip that outfit, your outfit should be looking like this. Now you can just walk away from the telescope and you should see that the helmet with the, the yellow and black checkered flight helmet should transfer over to this outfit. So now you can go ahead and go back into your closet area, your area, and just hit edit saved outfits. And you guys will see the, the flight tube, which is pretty cool that it just comes back onto your outfit. So now you can just save this outfit on whichever slot you want. After you do, after you do save the outfit, that's pretty much it for this outfit. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this yellow outfit. So let's go ahead and move on to the third outfit. When you are back at a clothing store, I'm going to go ahead and show you on how to make this third outfit. For this outfit, whenever you are at a clothing store, go over here to your tops. Once you are here at your tops, scroll down until you find designer hoodies, which is going to be right here on slot 37. Click on designer hoodies and you're going to want to go ahead and buy the off-white Manor hoodie, which is on slot 21. After you do buy the off-white Manor hoodie, you can back out of your tops, head over here to your pants. When you do get to your pants, click on jeans, which is on slot one and look for the midnight camo fitted, which is on slot 41 and just go ahead and equip those jeans. After you do equip those jeans, back out of the pants, head over here to the accessories. Once you are here at the accessories, scroll down to gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and you're gonna be looking for the black woolen gloves, which are on slot 58. After you do have the black woolen gloves, you can now back into your accessories, head over here to your shoes. Once you are here at the shoes, scroll down to sports shoes, which is on slot nine, click on sports shoes, 
and you're going to be looking for the all white sports shoes which is on slot 28 and now after you do have the all white sports shoes you can go ahead and back out head over here to your hats go ahead and scroll down to caps forward which is on slot 4 and you're going to be looking for the black bigness cap which is on slot 43 and go ahead and buy the black bigness cap after you do buy that uh after you do buy that forward cap you can now go ahead and back out head over here to the glasses whenever you are here at the glasses scroll down to sports glasses click on sports glasses and you're going to be buying the gray scale urban ski which is on slot 5. after you do buy the gray scale urban ski you can now back into the glasses and for this outfit you will want to go ahead and head to the mask store when you do get to the mask store, walk over here to the mask, scroll down to ski mask, which is on slot 19, and go ahead and buy the white tight ski, which is on slot 112. After you do buy the white tight ski, you will see that your goggles and your hat will come off. So now we're going to go ahead and do the telescope glitch so then we can combine the hat with the mask and glasses. When you do get near a telescope, go ahead and just do the telescope glitch. So go and run past the telescope, hit right on the D-pad. You'll see that your character glitches where his mask does come off. Pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, scroll down to your glasses, and just scroll through your glasses until you do find the grayscale urban ski. And once you do find the grayscale urban ski, you can just walk away from the telescope. So here's the grayscale urban ski, walk away from the telescope, and you should see that the mask and the glasses do combine. So now go ahead and do the telescope glitch again and you guys will see that your character glitches where his mask comes off and the glasses will still stay on but you guys are still glitched so go ahead and pull up your interaction menu scroll down to style scroll down to accessories and scroll through your hats until you do find the black bigness cap once you do find the black bigness cap you can now walk away from the telescope and you should see that the hat goggles and mask combine all together so now go ahead and pull up your interaction menu scroll down to style scroll down to hood and make sure you set it to up just like this and this is what your, your outfit will look like so now for the parachute pull up your interaction menu up again scroll down to style scroll down to parachute make sure it's set to on and scroll down to bag and make sure it's set to the black combat shoot bag if you don't have the black combat shoot bag go ahead and go to the gun store go up to the front counter Go up to parachutes, scroll down to parachute bags, look for the black combat shoe bag, and after you do buy the black combat shoe bag, go ahead and back out of the front counter and just equip it how I showed you right here. Now, for to finish off this outfit, I'm going to show you on how to transfer the flight tube over to this outfit. When you do get to a clothing store, one thing I did forget to say is whenever you are here at the clothing store, since we did add the parachute, go up to the front counter and just save this outfit again on any slot. And after you do save this outfit, you're going to want to go ahead and back out of your edit saved outfits, scroll on to flight suits, which is on slot 9, and go ahead and equip the black flight suit, which is on slot 2. After you did equip the black flight suit, you're now going to want to go ahead and run across the street to the strip club. When you do get to the strip club, go ahead and walk inside through the front door, and you'll see that the flight tube does come off this flight suit. So now, pull up your interaction menu. Scroll down to style, scroll down to your outfits, and go ahead and scroll down to the outfit we just saved. Go and equip that outfit. After you do equip that outfit, go ahead and walk back outside that door, and you should see that the flight tube does transfer over to this outfit. So make sure you don't get in the car, or make sure you don't get on your Oppressor Mark II, or else your hoodie will come off. So you're going to want to go ahead and run across the street again, and then just save this outfit inside the clothing store. Now that you did save the outfit, we can now go ahead and work on the final outfit. Okay guys, for the final outfit, you guys will want to go ahead and head to the Diamond Casino for this outfit. Whenever you are here at the Diamond Casino, go ahead and walk over here to the clothing section and walk over here to the tops. When you do get to the tops, scroll down to hoodies, which will be on slot 9, click on hoodies, and you're going to want to go ahead and look for the green bigness waterproof, which is on slot 26. After you do equip that hoodie, you can now go ahead back out of the tops and for the rest of this outfit, you will want to go ahead and head to a clothing store. After you do get to the clothing store, walk over here to your tops. When you do get to your tops, scroll down to utility vest, which is on slot 53. Click on utility vest 
and you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and buy the green straps vest, which is on slot 15. After you do buy the green straps vest, you can now back up the tops, walk over here to the pants section. Once you do get to the pants section, click on jeans, which is on the first slot, and you're gonna be equipping the black fitted, which is on slot 56. After you do equip the black fitted jeans, you can back out of the pants, head over here to your accessories. When you do get to the accessories, scroll down to gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and buy the white and green armored, which is on slot two. After you do buy the white and green armored gloves, go ahead and back out of the accessories, head over here to the shoes. Whenever you get to the shoes, scroll down to arena war shoes, which is on slot 14, and go ahead and look for the black and green light ups, which are on slot 39. After you do equip the black and green lineups, you can go ahead and back out. And for this outfit, walk over here to the glasses. Once you are here at the glasses, scroll down to sports glasses, click on sports glasses, and go ahead and look for the green urban ski, which are on slot 7, and go ahead and equip those uh, green urban ski goggles. After you do have the goggles, you can now back out of the glass section, and you're now going to want to go ahead and head to the mask door for this outfit. Whenever you do get to the mask door, walk over here to the mask, scroll down to the diamond casino heist, which is on slot six, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and buy and equip the green snake skin net gator, which is on slot 76. So after you do equip that net gator, you can now go ahead and back out, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and head to the pier so we can do the telescope glitch. So when you are near a telescope, either inside your apartment or at the pier, you can now go and do the telescope glitch. So go and run past the telescope, hit right on the D-pad, you'll see that your character glitches, and you guys will see that your character's mask comes off. So pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, and just scroll down to your glasses and scroll through your glasses until you do find the green scale urban ski. And whenever you do find the green scale urban ski, you can just walk away from the telescope. So here's the green, or here's the green urban ski. So go and walk away from the telescope and you'll see that the mask and the glasses do combine together. So now all you guys will need to do is just pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to hood, and just scroll one time to the right and you guys can set it to up. And now you can just go ahead and go to the clothing store, save this outfit on whichever slot you want, and that's pretty much it. And just letting you know, if you do get on a bike or if you do get inside of a car, your hood will come off. So if you guys are driving to the clothing store to save it, and if your hood comes off, just go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to your hood and just set it to up once you are at the clothing store. And then you can save your outfit with your hood up and it'll save forever until you do get inside of a car. Then you can just e re-equip your saved outfit and your hood will be back up. So that's... That's how you guys can fix that, but that's pretty much it for these outfits. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy these outfits. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.